welcome back to Sisters United. You are joined by player one and player two. And welcome back to our not so berry challenge with little Lene Berry, who in the last episode got married to Catherine and is now here happy. So happy. Doing our wee garden. I love it. We have Catherine over here planting some wild plants. We have little, our air coming out. Oh, we better go out, actually, and welcome the welcome wagon. Hi, or they might turn around and go, you're a horrible neighbour. We have our little air off to see the little bunny rabbit. And these are our twins. Identical twins, which we have discovered, and they look so much like Linnea and Linnea. Yeah, it's like the wee male versions of them. It's so adorable. They're out here playing in our little kind of kiddie oh, section. Oh, really? Very trusting yeah. that they'll not wander off into the wild. Yes. So, in this episode, we will continue to work on little Lanai's um, writing and skills. So, I'm going to come get her to resume the second book. And does she have work? She's got work tomorrow. So, yeah. And her birthday is in two days. So she's only got really either one or two days of work and then she's an adult anyway, which she'll be quitting the the business career and yeah. pursuing writing full time because I think she has the bug for it now in the country. Yes, yeah, like, Oh, and he's coming to watch his mummy. So we'll come see if he can pat the bunny. Very trusting. Oh, we need to call that rabbit. Fluffy. It's going to be his little detective rabbit. They'll go hunting the foxes together. This is partly why we wanted him to be in here, because his animal friends will help him solve woodland crimes. Oh, and he's having a wee nap in the tunnel. In the tunnel. You must got a board playing. And you're gonna go watch your mom. Okay, that's my done that. Eh, uh, hen, I told you to write. Get off, Jean. Very. Instead, we'll maybe reprimand them for going on her computer when she's trying to write. Jean, get off it, Daddy, just cook me the dish. He's not bothered. Her and Mrs. Grumplebottom would get on quite well. Yeah. <laughs> you enjoy my fruit cake? <laughs> nah, no, not really. <laughs> Pretty awful. Oh well, come here, Bruno. I've got a key for you so that you can come visit any time. Especially if you need a break. How is Linnea? She's doing okay. I'm sure she's pregnant. Yeah, she's pregnant. She's so moody right now. But I love her. Like, I'm your uncle. <laughs> Is that him wanting a cut off? Yeah. <laughs> Fawn's coming for it. It made a noise. Well, it's a clown, isn't it? Yeah. He's being a wee rat. He's playing in the books. Lana! He's in your favourite perspective! Done, Lene. So that's one thing done that we had to get done. So just her wellness, which we will let her do today as well. Ooh. Well, I suppose we could, couldn't we? Why can't I take the whole household? 
Oh, I'll bring the children over. Are you okay, Dad? <laughs> I'm okay. Oh, son. Hey, Dad. He's like, hey, son. He loves his boy. I love you, Dad. You said you like a full of your day. Uncle Opal's awesome. And he's just like, it's okay. It's okay, I have my grandson. He'll keep me safe. He'll keep me safe. Oh, are you trolling your pregnant wife? Hey, I did you do it? Your mom's right behind you. Your mom's right behind you, you know. The joke didn't go that far. Hey, did you see my mom died? Oh, I love food. Oh, it's so spicy. So her and Sea Hena seem to be not getting along as well. I'm a lot you bug me. This thing doesn't make you that sick. Are I have a condition. I can't fall back. Then why are you sick? Yeah, Hold on. <laughs> Hold on. <laughs> That's the reason she's a chef. So I don't need to eat the food. I love food. You be careful, sis. I will. I'm just trying to speed up the process. I have a sneaky suspicion that they've went to bed. Oh, wow. Hello, little kid. I just need to go to bed. I'm so tired. So, I think, you know, we, it was nice seeing the bams. But time for us to go. So, I'll send Catherine away with the kids. Who's in the toilet? I need to go. Let me in. This is my house! Quick spoiler! <laughs> You're gonna be the most beautiful! You're the manager that's gonna be! You'll rule the world! Maybe even a president! You should go for the top! Beer's ghost! Miles ghost! Saren? Saren, where are you? I know where is fucking Saren. Okay, fine, let's get you to bed. I know you hate going to bed. I'll read you a funny story about you and your little animal friend. I saw the leg. Oh, you're so cute, you little dinosaur outfit. <laughs> She's so excited. Okay. Excuse me. So. A little fun, but a detective of the country land. The little farm animals were his friends and his little detective assistants. They all went after the foxes who kept stealing the chicken eggs. The frog told Fun that no, oh, it wasn't, it wasn't it, it was a palm tree. <laughs> Oh, I'm not. Oh, stories are interesting, but sometimes they make no sense. Like, why would a palm tree steal an egg? Thank you, you go. And we get story for you too. The baby dinosaur. With little Harry. Little Harry protected the egg. And we bit as the T Rex chased him with a heart for strings. Far away he went. And then, as the baby dinosaur hatched. Sorry. He probably knocks them out with the gas. I'm sorry. Anyway, as the baby dinosaur hatched, it said its name was Littlefoot. I always fall asleep when I get to the best part. Good night. Maybe I should go do some yoga before bed. She could do. She could do a mind energy centering one and then go to sleep. Okay, energy centering. And she also has little adoring sentiments with her babies. Oh, it's like resting her foot against the wall. <laughs> well, actually, if you do do it that way, it's against the wall. They do do that. It's them leaning it. 
because they do different animations depending on where you have the yoga mat. When? Why do you have to just say Because ah, I'm sure the only other sin that had to master that, it. No, didn't have to master it. That mastered wellness was um, Megui. Megui and maybe Hannah Berry. But she was more into boxing. Yeah. But I think we had Megui just do it as a kind of hobby. Ah, uh, just a wee hobby to centre ourselves. <laughs> Nothing can ruin my mood. Nothing. Nothing. Well done. Nothing. I am as bendy as a pretzel. <laughs> I don't think pretzels are bendy. They are before they're baked. There she goes. Oh, hey, hey. Maybe she's got a bed though. It's 4am! Isn't that more comfy? You're... that you've got work in five hours. Yeah, but I better go to bed. But it was just so relaxing, I couldn't stop. <sighs> to work. Oh! <laughs> I have to go talk. Do you really have to? I do. I do. I can't. I want to make something out of my career. I got to. I'm sorry I said that. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Paul. I didn't mean it. But I said you probably made it into the second part of your career. But I will try that harder. <laughs> Oh, try a little harder to do for you. Well, she'll be like, hey, love me. <laughs> I'm gonna write so many books. Oh, that's why I've never got a lot of Oh, come on, Catherine, get up. I've got to go, I've got to go. <laughs> oh, let me be able to drive my cattle. I don't need to go a couple of nights. I do, I have work. Wow. Look at me, I'm gorgeous. Come, you can come meditate because by then she should have had her bath too. <gasps> Aww. While meditating, Lene very fondly recalled all good time she spent with Peaches McLeod. Oh, 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 oh. Okay. Ooh. Now, part of me is like, although she'd be late. Do I just let her get that? Yeah. Do, do we just I'm so let her? close. I'm sure they won't mind. Because, I mean, it's Lene. Because it's like... it could be part of... She quits, but she also... Um, gets a little fired. Gets a bit fired. And then we'll do what we did with Lene. We will let her go jogging so we can be nosy where she goes. When she gets back from university. Oh, back I'm... I go. Sometimes I wonder why I come home. Okay, so we're at level eight. So two more to go. But time to go. I have to go now. My phone is ringing. It's not ringing, ringing yet. She's only an hour late. No, her sister's ringtone. All oh, right. <laughs> okay, I'll go. I'll go. Just I have to come back down or I'll land badly. There. Okay, fine. I'm going. She's very happy. She does. She she makes me think of that ditzy kind of person at work who goes in late but is just like chill about it. Ah, oh, children, come on! I'll make some dinner for you. Aye, so no, what I will do is I will form a group with the toddlers. Or, well, actually, we can maybe add Catherine to it. And I will maybe get them a wee picnic basket. Hey, Catherine, I've been thinking about getting to know Sophie B. That's your fucking mother. <gasps> oh, yes. Got to know your mother a bit more. Why are you asking me permission? She's your mother. <laughs> not mine. I wish I had my mother. My mother died. Ah. We will put up our adoption. Oh. At least Bruno found me. And you come, children. This will really get your legs moving. This is what we used to do when we were little. Oh, I'm so excited. Come on. Wee. I love me. Wee. It is. I love me. 
it is a really pretty bit like I'll just teleport them, I think, Stop to Stop following me! There, so let's see them wait together. Come on, let's go to the girl! Oh, cold! Cold! Now you stay there! Where are you going? Are they gonna go over to the other side? I think so. They'll go away to um, daycare. Bruno's coming for you! <laughs> I love food. I just wish my stomach loved it too. <laughs> and she's like, Baby, he's to eat. Oh, we went to the river. How was work? Baby, no kid. Did you get promoted? No. Don't be scared. I could live at home. You know, I could live at home. <laughs> oh, but they've got to be sentiments about picnics. Oh, picnic bonding. Okay, so we had a glitch. And we finally got the game working again. And as you can see, we have moved on a bit during the day. And I decided to give them a little bit of a makeover. Not too much. I've just changed her hair. To be tied behind her, you know, because she's on the country lifestyle, she wants out of her face. And I gave Catherine a new outfit as well to kind of fit with the the country vibe. Yeah. So they still have their wee dresses and things that they like to wear, but we've also just given them a bit of a country look. Yeah, so yeah. heels aren't necessarily the best thing in country land. Yes, so we had a lovely little picnic. Picnic bonding. And we are working on... Lene's skills so she ha had reached level 8 of the wellness so we're getting to level 9 hopefully before she goes to sleep and then hopefully the next day we can get her to be complete that as well and then it's just our writing now I did finish a book and publish it as well and it didn't count as anything so I have cheated that published 10 books because I'm not sure if it wouldn't have worked until she did 10 books or not and we are going to be publishing 10 books anyway yeah. so my goal is by the end of this episode to try and get her at least on to three out of four of this yes and then that way the next episode would be the final episode of pink because she'll be becoming an adult maybe actually in this episode and she can quit her job yeah and then that would be the last episode of pink technically and we'd be moving on to peach who is aging up in five days so yeah. still a wee while yet adorable wee peach fawn yes and Catherine has got she's done her final exam for that one she still needs to do her final exam for this one and she's done uh, so she needs to do two more final exams so she's getting on quite I'm well I'm the dog oh I'm the dog and so when she ages up, which is in three days, because she's slightly younger than Lene, she'll be ready to hopefully become a chef. But what's the joke of all? Because she's going to be the breadwinner. Yeah. So even though she can quit her job as an adult, I think I might make her keep it just until Catherine has finished university. Yeah. And then once she's got the job, she'll quit her job then. Because Catherine knows how much she loves it. Yeah. And with three little ones, they're hard to juggle. Yes. Yay. Can I give fertility massages? <laughs> fertility? Uh, which means she can give a massage to somebody and it'll help them get pregnant. Though my sims never seem to have that problem. No, they don't. Even when. They shouldn't get pregnant. Yes. <laughs> we still haven't figured out what it is. Kathy. It's time for bed. I'm going to bed. I'm tired. Oh, it's all that meditating tiring. Cute. <laughs> but I should go for the goal. Oh, it might distress me. I'm thinking about going to the doctor about my 
mental condition. I'm thinking of it, so I had this just a problem. It's just annoying. I want to place my phone about the little kick it back up. I'm a chef, I need to taste my food. And please. Okay, maybe? Can yes, because they haven't had movies in a while. Of course, food. I passed by because I think I passed by as well. Congratulations, let me to eat. Aww. Snuggling together. This is so comfortable. And also. I discovered from Sophie what? that her and Loki have now entered elderhood. Oh. So I went and gave them a bit of a, a look. <gasps> Loki! You know, it's the silver fox as I thought. Yeah, so I thought with red hair it'd be more white. Well, with this hair option, there was not really a white one. Oh, really? Yeah, awesome. so they finally reached their elderhood, but we have them for 30 days, so they'll be around for a while yet. Yeah. Well, actually, let me just double check how long they'll be around for. She's got 30 days. Loki, you're gonna be here for ages! That'll be because he completed his aspiration. Yeah. Right, Lola, let's get Lena. Lena. <gasps> Lene, let's get you up to go work on that garden. Yeah. <laughs> be joining the competitions because we can take like our chickens down as well mm -hmm. oh well, i'm a fractionist this morning so as part of the story challenge for Catherine and for player two seat i can make her go to the hospital and then i will remove her wiggly stomach one and make out she gets medication for for it Oh, it could be something as simple as IBS. But actually, we'll do it after her university class because I don't want her missing any exam. Yes. I'm going to the doctors after my university. Oh, um, let's please settle in thy stomach. Hello, my love. Hello, my beautiful wife. Thank you, Tammy, so bad. I'm going to the hospital after my class. Oh. Yeah, no harm. Oh, uh -huh. oh god. Uh -huh. <laughs> She's so happy. Do you have work, Lenny? Have I made you all? Oh, she has made the crew work. I should maybe uh, make her go. Yeah, <laughs> I'm so bad. <laughs> you can go to work after your breakfast. Uh. She's inspired now, at least. Ooh. Oh no, she's Ooh. very happy. I think this lifestyle for her fits her quite well. I love you. Oh, it's actually her birthday today as well, so we'll need to bake a cake for her. So we're going to send Linnea, Catherine to the hospital and we'll take the toddlers in. We'll pretend it's like for their vaccinations. Yeah. Oh, Linnea must come, came for a visit. She looks like she's ready to pop. And although she's let her hair grow, she's still very much... The most feminine of them all. Wear yeah. wee heels. No country. I think I did give her a wee country look. So I'll maybe put it on her to see. That's her country. <laughs> That's as good as country as she's going. <laughs> oh, <sorry. Aww. laughs> oh, look at all these treasure that's in here. Yum. Demand a challenge. Oh, she's feeling uh, extra fierce. Oh, I just so much. I'm oh. panicking. No problem, she does like lime. In her cake. Oh, my back! I'm getting old! You still look beautiful. Oh my god! Do you still put makeup in your eyelashes? No, they stay pink. Oh, Lene. Lene, are you look ready to pop? Oh, it's adorable cake. Can I have a bit now? It's for your sister. It's her pop. Well, actually, it's her pop. It's her pop! It's her 
So what we'll do is when we age up Lene, we'll age her up straight after. <laughs> Yo, you! Oh, Lene, where are you from? <laughs> Lene, I think I'm from Lene. You can tell me anything. <laughs> She's very sad. <laughs> it's so me. It's so me. Well, we could always say they're on them plan, and they've agreed not to have any more until Lynn, until Catherine is in her career. Yeah. I'm not planning on having any more till I'm fully in my career. I'm nearly there. Just to more exams and then I'll... She got promoted! <laughs> to assistant manager. It helped me... Oh, oh. no! Happy birthday, my love! <laughs> I can't believe she got... <laughs> oh, she's in a wee pink suit. That's <laughs> quite cute. <laughs> oh, and there they go. The oldest two. <laughs> Oh. oh, you're gonna call promotion? Oh. Yeah, oh, I gave cute. very strict instructions to her little boss that if she demanded a challenge, she was to get a promotion. If she didn't, she was to stay where she is. Oh, so you tricked her. <laughs> she needs to move up in the family. Here she comes. In the business career. Now I wonder if I can get um Linnea to actually Linnea to do it herself actually. There we go. A little older, a little wiser, and she's only got to keep the job to, till Catherine does her finish this. So another, I don't know how many days. So yes, we'd just like to say thank you for watching. If you've enjoyed this episode, please leave a like and subscribe. And in the next episode, we will get Linnea to finish this. Yes. And we will get Catherine to finish university. Yes. And we will play with fun more as well. So yes, thank you for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye for now. Bye.